Hello, Emily and I are here to show you another item. Emily's uh, visiting the office this afternoon after school, and uh, she's very helpful, showing that helping me bring the items uh, to you here on on the video. Um, what we want to show you today is this large boxed item, which include which contains a uh, an extra large Japanese fan. Emily, can you show them the uh, regular size fan? Okay, this item is, is called a sensu in Japanese, and it's a folding fan suitable for use in, on hot summer months to keep yourself cool. And the item within this box is a very large sensu. Now let's open it up and take a look at the difference. So Emily has hers open, and I'll open mine. And if we uh, compare the two, let's put them like this, we can see just how much larger the, in fact it's so much bigger it's hard to see, you can see how much bigger the uh, this sensu is than the, than the standard size. And it would be a bit awkward to actually use this uh, to keep cool. The, there's a reason for the extra large size of this fan, and that reason is uh, given on the uh, box that it came in. The box uh, tells us that this is a, a Japanese fan for Kabuki Theater. Kabuki Theater is one of the uh, major types of theater in Japan, and it uh, is a traditional theater using costumes and masks and a lot of drama and very exciting. Um, much different than its uh, sister uh, form, No, which is more subdued. Kabuki Theater requires props, and uh, the props need to be extra large if they're on stage so that people in the back of the theater can see them, and that's why this fan is so large, so it was uh, could be visible on stage. And we can gain some further information about the fan if we look at the fan tines, and here they are, you can see up close, there's some Japanese writing there, can you see it right there? And that writing identifies the uh, name of uh, the person who used to own this fan as Kojima Fusa-san. Now that adds a bit of mystery because uh, that's a woman's name and Kabuki Theater is traditionally a theater for men only. Uh, women do not usually perform in Kabuki. So this name leads us to think that maybe this fan has had two lives, one in Kabuki Theater and two in the traditional style Japanese dance of Nihon Buyo. Now Nihon Buyo has a very distinct type of music. We're listening to that now and it involves uh, the women dancing on stage uh, using uh, fans such as, such, as, such as these to aug augment and accent their performance. So what we have here basically is a theater fan that has had two lives, possibly in Kabuki Theater as well as Nihon Buyo Theater. It's in very good shape with uh, no significant damage to note, just some stains and some minor fraying and otherwise ready for use as a display item or perhaps for theater again. What do you think Emily? Think it could be used? I think so. Thanks for your help, sweetie. Okay, but thanks for dropping by. Let's say bye, Emmy. Bye bye.